This is so cool. <laughs> oh my. Right, swarm number two for the year. I'm just sitting in my backyard, kind of watching the hives. Nothing going on, and all of a sudden I start hearing a hum entering my yard. <laughs> oh my goodness. Got this nuke box, just sitting on the fence line. Not too far away. I'm getting some uh, activity around it, so I'm hoping maybe I'll just find this and move in. So we'll see. All right, well they seem to kind of be wandering to this side. And there's that uh, little nook box I was telling you about a second ago. I'm really hoping they're heading that direction. They seem to be slowly wandering towards it. But this is so cool. <laughs> Got a little friend. Well, I was slightly wrong. You may recognize that one. <laughs> it's literally landing in the same space as the previous swarm did. I'm going to guess that there's probably maybe a still a scent uh, left on the branches from the past swarm. And maybe that's why they're flocking to this spot. That they just smell it and this is a good spot to rest, I guess. Who knows? I'm still kind of learning these things, but anywho, I guess I'll let them uh, collect on this branch and we'll do like we did the last one. The girls are fanning. That's awfully good sign. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Love it. We're going to assume the queen is in there. This pile of bees is just rushing inside. That pile is disappearing really quick. For all you squirmish people, let's just grab this ball. Yeah, they're very gentle. All right. Shook the remaining ball of bees into the hive. It's almost dinner time, so I'm going to let these kind of hang out and uh, move in for a while. So let me grab a lid here and uh, I'll just cap off the hive for now and let them kind of stroll on in just like that. So put that there. I don't think I see a queen up there now. Just some stragglers. It's all right. They seem really interested. Awesome. All right, we'll wrap this one up and then a couple days I'll go in there and see if I can't find the queen for you. Welcome back, folks. It's been about a week on this swarm. Let's open it up and uh, see how they're performing. I'm seeing plenty of new comb built. This was a smaller swarm than the last one, but uh, so far so good. It'll 
looking pretty healthy. Let's get a closer look. Phone died in the middle of that one. All right, there she is, right there. Nice and golden butt there. <laughs> uh, that's about a normal for what I see around here. That's the swarm we did last time. She, that was a wild looking queen, but there you go. Found this one. She looks nice and healthy. I'm seeing eggs laying. So let's put her back. See what else we can find in the hive. Comb slowly being drawn out. Plenty of nectar on it. This one's not as big as the previous swarm, so they haven't gotten as far as the other one did, but that's alright. She may have been a brand new queen when they when this swarm was cast, so it's alright. I'm happy with what I see. I'm just gonna leave them alone. There's nothing being drawn on these combs yet. But that's okay. But like I said, they've, they've got some time. They're, they're brand new. So let's put them back. And uh, let them girls do what those girls do best. Well, there you have it, folks. Yet another successful swarm catch of 2022. It's number two of the year. Queen's looking healthy. The colony's looking healthy. A little smaller than the last one, but that's okay. They... They all start out at different sizes. So anyway, I can't wait to see how this uh, colony performs. So in the future, hopefully I can get lots of honey from her. Anyway, if you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget, support your local beekeeper.